It's the Murphy's Law Podcast. Hey, 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 it's Thursday. So it's good to see you guys, all you cool cats and kittens. We're getting right to it with the agenda. Agenda review. We're trying to keep this podcast short because you are reading chapter six of Of Mice and Men today. So you want to make sure that you... Uh, get through chapter six. You have until Tuesday. We're finishing the novel through the weekend, so you have until Tuesday to finish the book. We only have a few weeks left, though, so we're going to be doing some writing and discussion based on the whole book. So you want to make sure that you get through to the end, finish the book, and look at and respond to the questions that are linked in Google Classroom. Now, there is a big clue here. I'm helping you out in the audio readings. What I highlight and what I talk about are going to be key parts for our future writings and discussions. So that is, that's your C that you could use in any future writing and discussion. So there you go. Don't say I never gave you anything. And uh, so now, uh, if you joined our Google Meet, hopefully we had a good discussion. I don't know because I'm recording this before that. And then all we're doing then is finishing the book and then you have the poem, Burning a Book, from Commonlet, you're responding to those questions. The final question has the potential for bonus points. If you watch the tutorial, I might even elaborate on that a little bit more. So let's take a look at uh, some Trivia Tuesday winners. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Chiming in at 8.26 a.m., Dylan S. comes up with the right answer. The guy can't marry his widow's sister. If, if it was his widow, the guy is dead. So, unfortunately, I got a great variety of responses, though, from somebody just saying, no, that's gross, to people giving me the historical relevance of the canon law in 1983. So, uh, Ava also elaborated a little bit more, said it would not be possible for him to marry his widow sister because he would be dead. So he cannot marry her. Doesn't matter what the law is. Thursday Thoughts. By this point in the novel, we've heard the dreams of several characters. There are several, especially the, dream, the people that are on the outcasts. You know, the people we see in chapter four, those are the outcasts of the novel. And they all have dreams. So the question then becomes, whose dream is more realistic and why so whose dream is more realistic and why that's your thursday thoughts so ponder that and read and that's all for this thursday episode so you have the time to do that we'll catch you on the flippity flip <laughs>